Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to install Mean GW compiler on your PC for running your C or C++ program. So guys, you can open any of your browser and just search for Mean GW download. Okay, and here you will be seeing one website sourceforge.net and here is the link Min JW that is minimalist GNU for Windows. Okay, so just click on this link. It will redirect you to this website and here you can see there is a download button and guys you can see there is lots of uh, download for this. Okay, so it is trustworthy website. You can just click on this download button to start the download. Okay, so your download will start shortly. You can see my download is started and it is done. Very small file, hardly in KB. So now I'm clicking on this exe. Let me minimize my browser. And guys, here I need to click on this install button to start the installation. So now guys, here you can see it is uh, showing me the installation directory for minjw that is c colon minjw. If you wish to change, you can click on change button and you can change the directory wherever you want to install. Now I will be clicking on this continue button to start the installation. Now guys, here it is downloading minjw installation manager. So in that manager, we will be having various options for selecting what kind of uh, software or packages we would like to install. So let's complete this download. Okay, guys, so here it is showing me 100% done. So you can see my continue button is enabled now. So I'm going to click on this continue button. This MinJW installation manager and here it is showing different packages and below it is showing no packages are selected so if you want to install all this you have to select it and these are the description like uh, it's a c compiler c plus plus compiler so we are going to install all the compiler all this so for that we have to select the package just select the package and click on marks for installation so you have to do this for all the packages so just select all the packages one by one and click on marks for installation guys so i have selected my all packages and i have checked marks for installation and now at left side you can see installation menu and just click on apply changes and here you click on apply button so guys for this you need internet connection throughout in, uh, for installing all these packages so you can see my packages are getting downloaded so one by one it will download all the packages so guys here it is showing me applying the schedule changes so this is the last step for installing this okay so now as soon as it gets complete it it will enable my close button so guys you can see all changes were applied successfully and i am getting my close button so you can click on this close button okay also you can cross this installation manager also so as you can see here, it's showing all the packages in green color. So that means it has been installed successfully. So now I'm just going to close this uh, MinJW installer manager. And after this, I have to set the path of uh, MinJW in my environmental variable. Okay, so I'm going to my C drive and in my C drive, you can see there is a folder MinJW. So what you have to do, you have to just click on this folder and inside this folder, there is what? bin folder so what you have to do you have to just copy the path of this bin folder so here you can copy the path and now in search box you have to just type env so it will uh, show you edit the environmental variable so here you need to click on environmental variable okay now guys under system variable select this path and click on edit and here click on new button and paste the copied path this was important step guys otherwise it will show you error now click on ok three times so the path has been set now i will open my command prompt and i will show you whether the command is working or not so cmd i have started and now here i will be typing command for showing version of my min gw so here guys you can see I'm just typing G++ space hyphen hyphen version. So you can see it is showing me G++ 6.3.4. Okay, so guys, this is a version of G++, the latest version. So now I'm just going to close this command prompt and I'm going to create a simple Hello World program just to show you how to compile and run your 
program okay so uh, for that guys i am going to create a folder on my desktop so here i am creating c demo folder and then uh, after that i am going to open notepad and in that i am going to write a code so my editor is notepad and using command prompt i will be running my program uh, so guys if you are familiar with uh, c programming this is an important line which we write always hash include stdio.h and then i am writing int main you can give void also so both will work then uh, print f and here i am going to print a simple message i am writing simple message welcome to the world of c and guys i am putting semicolon and since i have uh, given return type as int i am writing return 0 and i am closing curly bracket so now after this we have to save the program so just click control s or file save as and you can go to your folder so i have taken c demo folder and here save as file all files and give your file name any name dot c so i have given hello dot c guys my program is done i'm opening my folder and here i'm going to type cmd okay so it will start my command prompt with this path where i have saved my program so in my c demo you have seen i had hello.c program so now let's see the step for compilation so gcc space your file name dot c so hello dot c I, I don't have any error so i'm not getting any error so compilation is done you can see guys it has created exe for this particular file so now we will be running this exe so uh, what is my exe name it is a so here i'm going to simply type a and hit enter so boom guys you can see i'm getting my output welcome to the world of c so that's what your expected output now i'm going to my c file again I am going to change my program little bit. So here I am writing one more printf statement and I am adding happy learning to it. Okay and I am going to save this file. So control s or file save and since you have done changes you need to recompile. So again press a arrow key. So it will uh, type this command gcc hello.c and your program has been compiled and now um, we are going to run the exe. So type a again and hit enter guys and you can see it has reflected the changes also so we are getting output welcome to the world of c and the thing which we added right so this way you can install min gw compiler and you can run your c or c plus plus program i hope guys by watching my video you are successfully able to compile and run your c programming so guys if my video has really helped you do hit on like button and if you have any kind of query you can put in comment box i will surely reply to your queries i am sharing my different social media handler in description box you can follow me there also you can join my telegram channel i'm sharing lots of pdf notes freely on my telegram channel please join that and guys if you are new to my channel and if really my video has helped you do subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit on bell icon to receive notification from my channel thank you guys for watching my video till then i'll see you in my next video till then bye bye and take care